paving this shit crank. What's up you shady gang welcome back to another video but before we get into the video make sure you subscribe hit up your notification and like the video guys we are here today to talk about the industry sabotaging Tanasha Donna this is not a new conversation with my subscribers if you are not new on this channel then you know who are we have been talking about the industry the big people you know in the industry especially in the music industry trying to sabotage tanasha donna but guys you know who are tanasha donna it's almost like one year and a half fighting you know to get out in a bad contract with ziki that she signed while she was dating diamond platinum i we all know who are um, here bad contract arianza arianza they we i feel like the trouble started when she was no longer working with jamal if you don't know jamal and tangazaji he did manage tanasha for quite some time and when he was managing tanasha i ain't gonna lie she, he did an amazing job tanasha was popping we saw tanasha everywhere tanasha was performing but after Turiwana, the breakup between i don't i don't it's not a breakup i feel like they there is something happened something definitely did happen between tanasha and you know jamal because we all were, were, were surprised to see tanasha now no longer working with jamal and jamal was definitely doing the most he was going all the way out and after that we saw some you know what they came out and start spitting some inside tea exposing tanasha saying kuwa hayo maneno na jamal huko tanzania and i was like come on jamal mm -mm. so i won't be surprised if jamal is among of you know is a part of ziki is a part of the game trying to push tanasha out of the industry but guys to me on the the industry is no longer supporting tanasha donna because the sabotaging are getting worse tanasha did release not tanasha kuna huyu jama muimbaji alikuwa ameshirikisha tanasha kwa nyimbo inaitwa tonight anajiita sijui triple triple three and guys the song it had the worst promotion like it had zero promotion from tanasha to this guy and the song is flapping i was like who gave out the permission to release the song the song is a hit the song is an international hit and i feel like this is a hit that is getting wasted like come on i feel like this song they drop it to sabotage tanasha to make people especially a lot of haters to see kuwa she's no longer on demand like tanasha she, people are not tuning in to watch what she got going on i feel like they are trying to destroy her image they are trying to release i feel like ziki is behind it allegedly because I feel like Ziki is trying to put to prove to Tanasha Kua whenever she drop her music, it's it's not gonna. I feel like guys, let me be honest. I feel like Ziki is trying to sabotage Tanasha to make people see Kua she cannot do numbers without them because you know Kua the biggest hit that she have in her career Ziki was Merilizia under Ziki now kenda huko youtube or anywhere you're not gonna find those hits from tanasha like get like ile nyimbo yake na mboso na masauti ile nyimbo yake na ito sawa a lot of hits were deleted huko instagram and i feel like people need to wake up need to wake up and see kuwa the industry is after tanasha i feel like they are done with tanasha 
that's why they are trying to destroy her name they are trying to you know to show to other artists who are she's not on demand people are not tuning in so she you know it's very bad it's very bad they are trying to you know they are trying to sabotage her bag because if he, she's not doing big numbers no artist is gonna want to work with her i feel like this song tonight they drop it to sabotage tanasha because how come tanasha had to support this song had to post anything i feel like they drop the song behind tanasha i feel like tanasha has provided this song it dropped it come if the song is a hit it has zero promotion nobody knew that she was about to drop music i feel like this is a very big sabotaging they want other artists like big artists name to not work with tanasha because they're gonna say she's not doing numbers she's no longer doing no she's no longer doing big numbers and that is a very bad look but guys i feel like i feel like tanasha needs a new management new manager new everything and of course they need to be careful with you know whoever tanasha send a verse to because guys this song i'm a drop it was sabotaging her i feel like tanasha needs to work with artists who are bigger than her not the artists who are not bigger than her because she's still building her career i feel like if she works with those small artists it's gonna hurt her demand people are gonna say mm, she's not doing big numbers she's not you know big artists but if she works with those big people she's not only gonna be building her fan base to be bigger she's also going to be getting a good look right now she's not getting a good look when it's come to the music and i feel it's all because of the music industry they are against her they are sabotaging her but guys jump in the comments tell me your thoughts make sure you subscribe hit that bell notification i'm gonna see you in the next video